Hi everyone, so today I thought I'd show you something that I do every now and then that's kind of useful. Um, and so first, actually, you know what, I'm going to show you, this is the uh, feature of Bash. It's not um, like an NPM or Yarn or anything feature, it's a Bash feature. Um, and it is called Brace Expansion, and it allows you to do a lot of things. So here we'll take this for example, if I go echo those, then it's going to um, echo we each one of those, but in um, like not concatenated. So like if I were to put that in quotes, um, then it's gonna do the curly braces and everything. So what that basically does is it expands those things. So here, let's, uh, maybe this will be a better example. Free stuff and post stuff. What do you think that's going to print out? So every single one of these is going to get the pre stuff and post stuff. Um, and then, so it basically takes each one of those uh, inside the curly braces and all of the stuff around it and, and makes, um, yeah, just creates a um, entry, I guess, for each one of those as arguments to the command. So we can uh, do a lot of things with this. Uh, it even has uh, this dot, 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 which is pretty wild. I didn't actually know that it did that. So um, now it'll do A, B, C, D, E, F, G. Um, let's go Z. I wonder what would happen if I do capital. Yeah, I don't know. That probably makes sense to somebody who knows how characters work. But um, for our case, uh, situation, let's say that you're starting a new project and you have a bunch of roll-up plugins that you want to install. Uh, maybe there, there are two roll-up plugins that are common with each other. Or you just want to install a bunch. Um, so what you can do here, I have a... Uh, package JSON in here and we want to install those so I'm going to say yarn add as dev dependencies and I'll say roll up and then we'll say roll up dash and we'll add these curly braces and we want each one of these so we have babel common js json babel comma common js json etc 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 forever uh, so you just add one entry for each one of those rather than having to type out roll up dash uh, and actually, that's rollup dash plugin. Let's fix that. Woo, that was close. So instead of typing rollup dash plugin dash babel, rollup dash plugin dash common js, rollup dash, you know, you get the point. You can just do uh, the common part. Uh, and if there's um, stuff at the end, you can also do it at the end. Um, but that will expand it. It will resolve all the packages, install them all. Wow, that was fast. Uh, and you'll see they're all included. And if we um, will bat, our um, package JSON. And if you don't know what that is, go Google it. I um, am sure you will find it. Um, but yeah, so that'll get us all of our entries that we were looking for. Um, I'm gonna try something that I just that just occurred to me, um, which is nesting the, um, the brace expansion stuff. So here we have Babel core, Babel Jest, and then Babel plugin macros. So these two I want to expand. And then um, these, I also want to expand based off of these two, but they also have plugins in them. So what I'm gonna try, I don't know if this will work, we'll say yarn add as a dev dependency, babel, we'll do dash and then core and um, jest. And then we'll do another expansion here. We'll make sure we close that one off. Um, we'll do a dash there and then another expansion or actually it'll be dash plugin. Uh, actually, no, we've already got the dash. Dash is right there. So I say plugin, dash, and then the name of the plugin. Um, doo -doo -doo -doo. Uh, macros, minify dead code elimination. Okay, macros, minify dead code elimination. Hopefully I spelled that right. Um, and module resolver, we'll just do one more. Mo oops, module resolver. See if that works. Rats. Uh, I must have spelled that wrong. Boo. Okay, we'll just get rid of that one. I'm pretty sure this will work. So I'll just do those two. Come on now. Sweet. And then we'll uh, bat our package JSON. And we've got. Babel core, Babel jest. And so what that means is you can do nested brace expansions, which is pretty cool. So anyway, uh, this is going to be a short one today. Uh, that's all I really wanted to show. Um, brace, uh, bash brace expansion. 
pretty useful feature. I also use it sometimes if I want to do like remove uh, packages slash uh, context and button or something slash package lock or whatever, you know, like, so I want to remove something from um, directories that basically look the same except a, a piece. Um, so yeah, looks like there are no questions today. So um, I'm going to just sign off and answer a question on uh, my AMA. Um, stick it on three minutes with Kent, my three minute podcast. I choose a question to answer from my AMA. So if you have any questions that you watch this later and you want to ask a question about something, you can comment on the video um, and I'll try to respond or you can ask it on my AMA and uh, yeah. I'll answer it on my podcast, maybe. Okay, sweet. Thanks. I uh, hope you have a nice day, and I will see you all later. Um, yeah, goodbye.